welcome guys to case diary youtube is so saturated these days that if you do not get the right tips as to how to start your youtube channel you're going to fail like i'm seriously telling you you're going to fail so today i'm going to be giving you tips on how to create your youtube channel and make it a good one so stay tuned things that most youtubers are not going to tell you yeah so the first one is that your equipment it doesn't matter what you're starting with as far as you have a phone you can start with your phone however it is but i would advise you that the your, the phone you should actually be using should have a very clear camera so i would advise you if you could start with that if you could have an iphone maybe from iphone 5s to from from iphone 5s upward it would really help you a lot yeah it would really help you a lot so guys if you want to see the end of my makeup please stay tuned like stay tuned so that you're going to see the end of my makeup i'm actually showing you that right now <laughs> and the second thing you should put into consideration is your lighting actually i make i make use of natural light and i would also tell you one thing it is best to make use of your, the weather when this when sun is not shining so much because when you make use of sun and it's actually resting on your face your video comes out and people don't actually see your face because of the kind of camera you're using there's something that when you join sunlight and camera together phone camera especially is not really going to come out well so i'll advise you to make use of natural light when the weather is really warm and i'll also advise you to invest on ring light ring light will really help you that means you can actually film anytime you can actually film anytime so I'll i'm also actually thinking of investing on ring light so let's go there so sorry guys about the um, noise you're hearing from the background of the main video i couldn't actually control them because <laughs> they are from a different compound so please i'm very sorry about that so the third thing you should put into consideration is consistency consistency in youtube really helps and youtube algorithm algorithm helps consistency when you continue to post a uh, youtube algorithm uh, understands your channel as a channel that normally posts maybe every tuesday or every tuesday and friday it really helps because youtube algorithm is now being able to send your videos to people's home page to people's home page when they notice that this is the amount of time you post and it and talking about consistency knowing the time you post you upload your videos would also help you especially if you're uploading your videos during this quarantine season it will really help because most people just stay at home and they are they are just watching youtube videos they don't have anything doing things like that so it will really help you to post during this period that people are actually watching most mostly youtube videos mostly television and every other thing <laughs> if you loved the video so far i would really appreciate it if you click on the subscribe button and also ring the bell so that you'll be one of the first people that would receive my new video whenever i upload one the next thing that i would love to talk, tell you is um editing oh my god the, i would i would say that quality over quantity is always the best yeah quality over quantity is always the best most people in youtube use final cut pro some people use imovie but i make use of vllo i don't know if it has any pronunciation but i make use of vllo and it really helps me a lot like i got it i bought it actually but you can also use it for free but there are some things that you will not be able to like um there are some things you will not be able to assess there are some features in vllo that you won't be able to assess until you buy them so i just had to buy it and it's a one-time buying it's really cheap yeah it's really cheap so it's a one-time buying and editing really helps it shows how professional your youtube channel is it shows how professional your youtube channel is it shows how how you respect your subscribers by giving them something that has quality by giving them something that has quality another thing that most youtubers won't tell you 
monetization on YouTube, you won't just get it after five days or after 10 days or most at times people get monetized after four years so you need to keep on going you don't need to get depressed about maybe people viewing your channel and they are not um, you're having over 50 subscribers and only four people that view your channel you don't need to get depressed you don't need to get tired what you just need to do is keep on pushing in youtube you will have ups and down you have places that you get stuck but what you just need to do in YouTube is keep on going, keep on going, keep on moving. Another thing I would also want to tell you is that you're going to receive hate, hate comments and everything. Like there was, there was something that, there was, I can't actually remember the video I posted on YouTube and someone was like, I posted a fake video, yeah, I posted a fake video and someone was like, does it matter? Oh my god i'm going to i'm going to check it out and i'll put the video up here and the person was like does it matter most of the times you get hit comments but what what i'm trying to tell you is that you shouldn't get tired like it shouldn't bring you down we're all humans if you don't get hit comments that means you you've not said you've not you're you're not yet progressing yeah you're not yet progressing so i would also tell you that you have hit comments and every other thing like that but keep on moving and i want to also tell you your thumbnails I don't know if you know what is thumbnail, but your thumbnail is supposed to be dope because that is what is going to make people click on your videos. Your thumbnail, you should put in a lot of time in making your thumbnail because it is what is going to make people click to click your videos. Yeah, it's what's going to make people click your videos. And okay, another thing that I would want to tell you about YouTube is that there is something called channel banner most of the times when people go into your channel your channel page main main they see that and you should be able to tell them when you post on that your channel banner and what your channel is all about what your channel is all about guys i'm going to give an uh, a part two of this um i'm going to give a part two of this topic so i would ex i would love if you if you <coughs> So I would love if you subscribe and please give this video a like and also comment. I also feel that I should be able to I've learnt I've learnt a lot about YouTube algorithm in this stay at home period. And if you would really want to know more about YouTube algorithm, please comment in the comment section below and let me know if you're interested because if I don't see over five people commenting that they really want to learn about YouTube algorithm. I'm not gonna say anything yeah I'm not gonna say anything so I know that you want to know so comment in the comment section below and thanks for watching I hope my tips these tips I gave you really helped and uh, see you in my next video thank you